I have a couple of these reusable heat packs here and the standard explanation you often hear associated with these heat packs is that there's a mixture of sodium acetate and water inside these heat packs and what you can do is you can put them in boiling water and the sodium acetate dissolves and forms a liquid with the with the water to make a liquid and then when you click a little, flex a little disc inside the um, liquid it starts causing crystals of sodium acetate to, to form and you produce heat and uh, it's often couched in terms of supersaturated solutions but I have a question I'm a little confused here as you can see these heat packs both contain solid and liquid together the one on the right has more solid and the one on the uh, left has less solid but they still work I'm going to flex this one so you can see what happens here flex the disc and you can see when it pops you can see the uh, uh, crystallization of the sodium acetate and um, it converts to a solid okay so how come this doesn't happen when there's crystals already present in that liquid why don't those act as a nucleation source now I have this one on the right which it looks pretty slushy right now but it also has the sodium acetate water and it has the disc and I have a th uh, thermometer underneath this one on a timer I'm graphing the temperature so I'm going to flex this one too and you can see that that is also uh, radiating out and it's going from that slushy material to a solid and as you can see the heat is dramatically increasing again that thermometer the probe is underneath the heat pack and so if I want to reset these what I can do is I can simply take the heat packs and put them into boiling water and uh, redissolve that sodium acetate but again where I'm a little confused is why are there sometimes crystals still remaining and how come they don't renucleate how come, how come they don't prevent this from dissolving in the first place or why don't they all automatically pop or quickly pop back into the solid state so I'm seeking some insights on this